Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. In this video, I will try to give some explanation about the learning media and ICT course. So, let's introduce myself. My name is Muhammad Ilham. I'm from Economic Education Department, Faculty of Economic, State University of Padang. Student ID number 19053049. So, uh, let's begin with our material. We are talking about the model of learning media. So, previously, I had a reading of two, two journals and made a reading report. In this PPT, I will draw a conclusion based on the result of my reading by linking it to the learning syllabus. So, the first material we are talking about the Astor of model. So, the Astor model by expert. The, the expert defined the R5 point in the Astor model. The first is procedural. First is procedural instruction for planning and carrying out learning that involve media in the learning process. The second, the Astor model is a systematic approach to making lesson plans. The third is the planning needed by teachers. The fourth, a plan that is used to help teacher conduct authentic assessment of students who are learning. The fifth is the is an alternative for reference for present of knowledge. The next is the Astro is the have a like a acronym. The A is analyze of learner. The S is starting objective. The S is select method media and material. The U is the utilize method media and material. R is require learning participation. A is uh, evaluate and revise. So the conclusion of the Astor model. The Astor model is a learning model designed to focus on creating an effect efficient learning, especially in learning activities that use med media and technology. In addition to developing the learning design with the implementation of the Astor model in the learning process, teachers also use the concept of integrated thematic learning, where this uh, this integrated Thematic learning is learning that links several fields of study into an interest integral time to provide real experience for students so that they can develop student knowledge and improve learning outcomes for students. In addition, it also helps teachers in evaluating the learning process that has been implemented. Uh, the next is the, we are talking the second material is the model of learning media based on Anderson. So the, we have in other sunset they have a two approach in selection learning media. The first is collection close selection. The close selection of course with alternative media and learning have been determined determined by the top educational institution such as the education office. So basically we have to use a media in the learning process. The second is the open selection. The open selection model free for us to determine what media we want to use in the learning process. Here, there are many media choices and there is no st stipulation which media we should use. However, this open selection process requires the ability and skill of teacher to carry out the selection process. This, the, we have a several factors must be done by the teacher in choosing a learning media. The first is goal factor, the second is effective, effectiveness factor, the third is factor ability of teachers and students, the third is flexibility factor, the fifth is media affability factor, the sixth is the match factor between benefit and cost, and the last is the quality and technique of factor. Uh, the next is several step in selection determination of the type media determination, namely, Determine whether the message that we will convey through the media is learning message or just general information on entertainment. The second is determine whether the media is designed for a learning purpose or just teaching uh, at for teachers. The next is determine whether whether the learning objective are more cognitive, affective, or psychomotor. The next is determine the type media that is suitable for the type of goal to be achieved, taking into account other criteria such as policies, available facilities, production capabilities, and costs. And the last is uh, reviewing the type of media that has been selected, whether 
to this appropriate or there are still weakness or there are other more appropriate alternative types of media planning, developing, and producing media. So this is the chart of the Anderson Learning Media. This chart is illustration of the instructional how med, uh, instructional media design process. The first step, we, as we know, we must to know the information and and uh, instruction of our media. The second step is we must to know the the method of our learning. The third is we must to know the characteristic of the le learning. The fourth is the we must choose the, our media. And the next is uh, we must in the five is we must evaluating of our media, and the last is we must do uh, uh, the planning uh, the the planning of development of our media. The next is the strategies for using learning media in the process. Learn how to teach. Uh, the fifth the first is fix, fixative characteristic. This feature describe the ability of the media to record, save, preserve. And, and reconstruct an event of or object. The second is manipulative characteristic. The transformation of an event in a possible because the media has manipulative characteristic. And the last is distributive characteristic. The distributive characteristic of the media allow an object or even are transport truck space and the same time the incident was present to a large number of students with relatively the same experiential stimulus about the incident. So I think enough for my material and my explanation. Thank you so much and sorry for my mistake. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.